she was a baby, honestly. She was a kid looking for a handout. And she had this pathetic line, like, about her grandmother saying that she had a gift or something. Oh, Christy, when are you going to learn to keep your mouth shut? Okay, 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 stop. Now, you think I'm worried, right? You know, I never know about you. You're young, wacky about these things. Sometimes. Hey, watch what you say about my intended there, Listen, Mrs. Carson. You want, uh, you want some of my pals from the force to go down and check this kid out? I mean, we pick up scam artists like this all the time. She wouldn't even qualify, man. She was underage. Um, okay. Well, just anybody who's going to try and throw a monkey wrench into this, this marriage has to answer to me. Come on. What are you worrying about? You've already had two dress rehearsals. I mean, the third one has to be blessed. <laughs> Right, and you just X out any of this baby psychic stuff I, I brought up. So. Listen, I really have to go. Uh, why don't we talk tomorrow? I'll talk to the chef, and then we'll go over the, uh, the menu. I'll walk into your car. Yes, Ryan, bye-bye. I've got to take off and oh, see okay. Douglas, too, honey. Okay, listen, how is he doing? Yeah. No, he, he, he's not awfully good. Oh, I'm just, sorry. No, but don't you don't you worry about it. You just, you just think happy wedding, okay? Okay. Bye, Ryan. Okay. Yeah, fine. No, I don't think you are. What's going on? No, I just needed some fresh air, that's all. Is this about Felicia, about the wedding plans? No, listen, you won't tell Mary Frances. I mean, I hate to put you in that position, but I've already upset her so much today, and I've just been so preoccupied. Does this have to do with Douglas? The doctor said that this could eventually affect his mind. It's, I don't know, something about lack of oxygen to the brain. I don't know. Well, what's been happening? He's just not the same, Cass. He's nice sometimes, and then just as quickly he's not. And he can be very, very hurtful. You don't have to cover it with me, you know. Oh, come on, what? I'm sorry you had to run into all of that wedding stuff here. That can't have been easy for you. Yeah, actually, I'm okay with it. I'm gonna be even better with it tomorrow after Grant and Vicky are finally married. And they go off on their honeymoon. I just want this all to be over.